Hello there and welcome back to this game where if you didn't see last time then uh, I made this desk. I also made all of this stuff because this is all new if you can't tell already. Uh, uh, yeah. My phone is going off, one sec. It was my friends telling me to go and touch grass. Ah, jokes on them. No. I'm, I'm joking, of course. I don't, I don't go and regularly touch grass. Uh, I say, very honestly. Anyway, so today, not really sure what we're going to be doing. Uh, something fun, definitely. Hey, I just realized this map doesn't work on land because the sonar probably, but it works in the water. Strange. Anyway, so let's go off with a nice start. That being to go and find pilot last known position. Because last time we went, we were not in fact able to find the last known position. Is my inventory okay? No. I'm gonna go turn around before we even started our trip. So I've loaded myself down to the essentials. And I can't remember, do these icebergs move? They might. Either way, the reason I'm going over here is because I think that when you do this you unlock a place to go actually no I think that you unlock a quest to get a thing for the place to go to get a really really good food source and it I think is the best food source in Subnautica and Subnautica Below Zero combined probably oh hey look a wreck I wonder if there's any useful stuff here oh, I just realized do I have the rubber there yes I do Okay, right, let's go and look for some very useful stuff. I can't see a single thing because of that bright, bright, brightness. Oh, actually, these are some of the things that I wanted. Okay, well, not this specific one. Hello, command chair. Oh, that's interesting. Those fish can actually go... No. Has that thing woken up yet? I hope not. Too late, it's definitely woken up now. Run, run, run! Yay, we're alive. Ooh, three pop discs. Very, very interesting name. I'd rather go out with a fight, you know? Just, just go for that epic, epicness, you know? Yeah. You know, seeing as there's some sea trip fragments over here, I'm guessing that they ran into this, maybe. And, uh... I actually, I'm guessing that this voice log will tell us exactly what happened. Control room rapid depressur depressurization. Oh. Oof. That. That sounds. Wow. So, control room, soon, somewhere, I hope. Any more stuff for me to scan, though? I do not think so, apart from that seizure rock fragment, and, uh, I don't think we actually have a seizure rock yet, so that might be kind of useful. I really want to find more seizure rock fragments. Where are they? Give them to me. Anyway, back on our way now. Okay, then we have approached this place. Up faster, up faster. Okay, I'm going to leave it at about 140 meters, so that's right by this. And, uh, that's a squid shark. Do not want to go near that. And, yeah, we, we are on a time schedule limit thing. So we need to go fast. These sea monkey nests are great. So I've been swimming around. I found some stuff. There's probably two more of these fragment nests. And that means that, yeah, I found this. Was that a sea monkey that just tried to steal stuff from me? Ah, yes, it was. That was close. I do not like it when sea monkeys steal from me. Oh. oh, I know where we're going. Oh, yeah, that's the cotton whatever zone. Oh, <laughs> I do not need to go over there. But I may as well leave behind a beacon. Because I'm going to definitely remember where this is. I don't know. 
Totten Zone. I've named it that because you'll see later in the series. I think I got this now. Yay, Exosuit Thrower, Thrower Reactor. Thrower I <laughs> And I'm on the right track. Because those light thingies definitely don't look natural. Yay. Pretty, sure, pretty, pretty soon I probably will hear something or see something apparently I thought that I would I tell you to stay away well from what I don't even know who you are Marguerite made us an here on my turf. wow great can I come in and warm up what part of go away do you not understand Altera I'm not with Altera Can I see anything? I see a PDA. Apart from that, no. And a large room. Oh, with a window. What's in here? Nothing of interest. Okay. And what's down here? Whoa. Oh, that's the uh, that's the uh, crystal caves or whatever, isn't it? Oh, a prawn suit. Whoa. Wish we could customize the prawn suit like this, but that thing looks epic. And a moon pool, whoa. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Signal location uploaded to PDA, what? What, what is it? What, what is it? Alien distress call origin. I'm pretty sure we've got that already. Don't we? No, that's the new one. Hmm. Well, let's see what's in here. Surely won't be anything bad, right? Bonjour, old person. You trained that thing? Next time I'll let him tear you to ribbons, Altera. I'm not that Reaper Altera. skull is just I'm so I... cool. I'm looking for information about my sister Sam. I think you might have crossed paths. Bull crap. I suggest you take the time you need to come to your senses and then get off my seat. Oh, a blue tablet. If you're not Altera, why don't you disable that damn tracking satellite tower instead of barging into my sea base? Maybe once Altera's off my back, I'll remember something about your sister. There's some junk on that table that might help. Well, I, I guess we no I guess I know what we're doing this episode. It's you don't realize how massive those things are. The the ice whatever stalkers. Snowfox. Ooh, yay, fun. I need some more fragments and their server ride module. New blueprint synthesized. Teacher perimeter defense. New okay, well, sorry, sorry about stealing, but hello, hello, Snow Stalker. You're a good boy, aren't you? Honestly, they're kind of cute. I say, is he? Oh, I want that. Anything else interesting or important, though? I guess this. That far out to sea, swimming back for land wasn't an option. I'd die from exhaustion long before I made it to shore. All I could do was survive long enough to wash up somewhere. I felt a suction, and suddenly. There were vast jaws rising out of the water towards me. It had taken hours for the Reaper's corpse to float to the surface. Using the knife, I clambered up her flank and got a perch on top. I figured she'd float for a few days at least. Enough for me to catch my breath. But would she sink before or after I died of thirst? I had a knife, a repair tool, and three liters of water. At least I wasn't going to die of exhaustion. Now, those Reapers, they're practically all muscle. But there's some fat in there. I was able to keep warm and drink the water. And I didn't have much. But I had that repair tool. So I had a spark. It took a week to light that first fire. And I know more about the burning properties of Reaper fat than I ever cared to. I had to ration fires. 
But as they burned, I could smoke meat that I carved out of the beast's rib cage. Where's your survival skills? And I just realized why this thing is so hard to get. Because I was just looking at the pinned recipe and I noticed, hang on a minute. What's that strange capsule looking thing? It's a parallel processing unit. Oh, oh I don't want to have to make those. Okay, that thing is a bit too close for comfort. Now, where is the place that I need to go and get it? I think that I need to go towards Delta Station Dock. Where is where is it? But where is that? Where where that where where is that? Over here. And I just realized while well, we're at the sea truck. Oh my goodness! What was that, brute shark? Probably. Yeah, it was okay. Anyway. Why don't we put this in? Like, definitely not stolen perimeter defense upgrade, which we are not going to use because it drains power like mad. And I've already found what I was looking for, and I just remembered I might need a laser cutter to enter this thing. Good thing I have that unlocked, right? Never mind. Got a single fragment that I found in a cave somewhere. I'm glad that my submechanophobia doesn't get triggered by games. Because I've got this one phobia that basically makes me scared of this if it was in real life. I would not be able to go in a submarine around this thing because I'd have a panic attack and drown or something like that probably. So uh, yeah. Oh, and of course the first door I see. Okay, well, well I found a way around. Okay then. Titanium ingot, what? I was expecting to get some food or a drink. Okay, a battery that's still not edible. Don't try, please. What is it telling me to scan? I'm not sure. Oh yeah, I need a laser cutter to get the parallel processing units out. Okay, well. Hopefully I can find some... Uh, what's it called? Fragments. I need that. Oh, plant. More batteries, really? That is not really what I need right now. Mercury 2 PDA. Uh, I can only do repairs in spurts. It's so inefficient. The larger One of three. Set off seismic activity nearby. A crew came back telling stories of gigantic worms burrowing in the ice. I don't know what they're all going on about. They were hypothermic and frostbitten because they walked back to avoid anger. My shelf is probably a bit unstable and they got disoriented or something. To borrow from Diana. Orion's belt, thermal couplings, are not meant to be worked on in 20 minute spurts. If we break the process, we'll break the ship. <sighs> but it's nice to hang out with Yasmin while we wait for the rumbles to stop. Her face lights up and she's got the most expressive eyebrows. They're practically acrobats. The way she looks when talking about nuclear engineering See, is the same way I look at my what? grandmother's domades. Huh? The never sits down though. She told me that she used to do decathlon in college, and I can believe it. She's like a bouncy ball, just all over the place. She makes rounds on the ship every day to see if people need help. Hmm. I should do something nice for her. She's always helping everyone else. I had a fraction of her energy. <laughs> oh, looks like we got a little workplace romance going on. Oh. Anyway. Where are the laser cutter fragments? Please. I need them. Metal salvage. Just got a wiring kit from a supply crate. That's, that's crazy. Either way, I think that I found the way to get up to the, uh, the fragment. Yay. Laser cutter. Yay. Yay. Laser cutter fragment. So good. Perfect. Yay. Oh. So, hang on. What do we need for that? Please don't tell me it's too expensive. Diamonds? Diamonds? What is this, Minecraft? Why are we using diamonds to craft things with? I scanned a fish. <laughs> Warning. 
Right, now I need to remember where I can get diamonds from. Which I'm, I'm hopefully, I'm hoping that, that I can get them from here. In this biome. I'm not very sure though, also I do need the cave sulfur. That is not cave sulfur, that is crystalline sulfur, which I've already got, but never mind. I got it at home. Hello, Mr. Cryptosuchus man. Hey, jump scare. Oh, got you there, didn't I? Ah. Aha. Uh -huh. Did you get jump scared by that? Ah. I'm also going to build a sea truck dock, by the way. I thought I'd mention that. But I want more sea truck stuff fragments. Why can't I find any? I want to fabricate the module. I want a sleeper module. I want... I want storage. I want the aquarium. I want to look at the, all the pretty fishies, you know? I need to see the pretty fishies. Oh, we're tailing. Looks so pretty, wow. You think people will be angry at me if I drown while building? <laughs> right by the surface as well. Pro probably not, right? Probably not. Oh, yay, some special minerals. And an ore vein. Oh, it's so much better in Minecraft. And so we're going to get a little bit of very good stuff. Compared to the Minecraft where you can get uh, like hundreds of iron. Or copper, but no one really wants hundreds of copper. Speaking of, if you want Minecraft to come back to this channel and leave a like on this video. I could probably do a playthrough in the poisonous potato snapshot. Because that would be fun. I'm under an ice shop and I need to breathe. Help. And it is time to construct the sea truck dock. Let me in. Let me in. Oh, wow. We've got barely any base health. Okay. Yes, and I might have to build some of these. Okay, I need more lithium. Which I also need for the upgrade of the, for this thingy. Okay. Nothing docked. Okay, well, watch this. This, this thing is so cool. I don't like the days from when you had to put this thing in a moon pool and it would just dump all of the attachments and then first of all you couldn't have them really connected to power but second of all you'd just you'd have to go outside and then reconnect them manually after those days were painful and the water was drained and I can just exit base from here got the sea truck oh, so cool how just the sea truck is Weird noises. Oh yeah, I forgot that we can actually change the color of this now. And we got different cameras as well. Oh, it's so cool. I forgot how fun that stuff was. You're gonna have to move that poster. Poster one. And go. Here. Picture can go back there. Here. There we go. I don't know how I missed this before. But yay. Well, I already have the blueprint for the control room. Okay, well, too late now. I need to run away from the big angry fish. Well, it's not very big. It's actually just kind of small. I need to run away from the small angry fish. And then I might need to run away from the big angry one if it gets angry at me. The big angry fish is angry at me. Oh no, now the other big angry fish is also angry at me. Oh, what's that? Is that a fragment? No, it's just a piece of salt. Okay. Be detected below. Beware of high pressure and temperatures. Yo, oh, give that. That is not a crypto circus. That. That is not a crypto circus. That. <laughs> yep. Bleeper module, yay. That is most definitely not a crypto circus. That thing is massive. Okay, well, I'm going down here and hopefully I can find some more stuff like a sleeper module. <gasps> oh, and a data box. Yay, exciting. It's a booster tank. Does that allow me to sprint or something underwater by sacrificing air? Oh, well, I just sort of a big problem. I'm not going to be able to get to the surface from here. Unless I just blast past that big fish. 
Haha, <laughs> joke's on you. Uh, there's no way to get up on this iceberg, is there? Okay, okay, okay. The big shrimp is angry. The big shrimp is angry at me. The big shrimp is angry at me. Please don't tell me it's fast. Please don't tell me it's fast. How fast is it? How fast is it? Is it gone now? Please tell me it's gone now. Uh, okay. What's down here? What's through these little winding caves? Nothing interesting. Okay, so I take that back. Will it? Probably not. Ooh. Okay, maybe I was wrong, I guess. Fragment. That's not a fragment, that's disappointing. I have to take body cash. Batteries. Why? Why are these here? Of all places, this... Uh, why? So I was just swimming and I look up and I see the silhouette of that shrimp. I really hope that that thing doesn't get angry at me because I have a feeling that if it does that I'm not getting out there. Oh great, 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. I hope that the big fish is not somewhere near me right now. That would be terrible. Oh, another fragment. I think it's just a sleeper module though. Ah, I already have that. Ah, I'm scared. Oxygen. Okay, we are very low on oxygen. Oh, I hear the fish. Where is it? Where is the big shrimp? I think that we're safe. We may have survived. I'm scared. Let me go on the iceberg, please. Good news. I know where the big shrimp is. I think it. I think it might have some tiny bit of brain damage, but apart from that, I think we're fine. I hope. That was a sea truck docking module fragment. I just slammed my mouse as I tried to unpause the recording. Uh, oh wow, big boat. Yeah, jukebox fragment. Miracle of Sound, I'm pretty sure that's a good one. And we can't get that, of course not. This game, though, I used to do everything in its power to make me fail. I got a sealed supply crate, so I can't even get that. That's really all there is. I'm disappointed. This is tiny. Problem. Uh, oxygen. And also another problem. Uh, iceberg. And maybe potentially big fish, which I hope is not a problem. Oh wow, we are so much lower down than I thought we were, but we make it. No idea how you'd land at a fall like that. Whoa. The, uh, the lightning looks epic. And I'm probably going to go back to my sea truck now. While well, doing my best to avoid all of the big angry fish. And getting a call. Hey, excuse me? Excuse you? My body is anything but Literally. The brain's all connected. Is there anything you don't find primitive? Humans bartered with evolution to get more brain wrinkles and opposable thumbs. It is true. Opposable thumb is excellent, but all corporeal forms are temporary. The ability to be reborn when a body breaks down is paramount. My body is my own, and I cherish it. It grows with me. Humans my body is a temple, life. big fish. We plant trees Those things are a joke. The shade of. We build for the next generation. Noble, but again, truly inefficient. You are incredibly frustrating, you know that? I hope to see the forms of my people again. Let me, please, I need some copper. I want to build the laser cutter, please. There we go, finally. Now, how many, how many, I just realized I need to make a fabricator as well. Hopefully that's not too difficult. It does not need more copper. Oh, it needs two, okay. How many, how many does this need? Just one, okay, then. Fun fact, I would have been done by now if I decided to just go back to the base. And build stuff there instead of trying to build stuff here right now. So, uh. I have a feeling that I'm about to die. Let me in, let me in! Important artifact, okay. Got it. Signal location uploaded to PDA. So. Okay. 
Is that the one that we've already been to? It might not be. Anyway, where is the base? It's over here. Modification station built, which means I can build a thermoblade, yay. Ultra high capacity tank, yay. Yeah, that's gonna be it for this video because I've run out of time. And I'm actually not trying to keep them short now. Anyway, so what happened? We got a laser cutter, we've got an ultra high capacity tank, and we've got wait for it. Thermoblade. Yeah, I, I said wait for it because I could not remember what we had. But uh yeah, that's gonna be it for this video, so yeah. Uh I need to go make the thumbnail actually. So it's gonna save the game quickly. And uh yeah, like and subscribe. We've done a lot of stuff today and I'm for the thumbnail you you actually already know what I'm gonna pick because you clicked the thumbnail when you wanted to watch this video. So uh yeah. You ought to know what the titles are gonna be, so please tell me because I'm not sure what I'm gonna make it yet. But hey, that's gonna be it for this video. Uh like, subscribe, all that stuff, you know. Fun stuff. Two hundred and two subscribers now, so that's great. And uh, yeah, we'll see you all next time. Bye.